so we are going to use this this column of resources because it has resource initials it's what we are going to use in order for us to determine the project cost yeah. so we come back to our work here where, where, where the, there is a resource name we shall put the initials that were given in the question and the first initial the first initial is on identify user requirements and it is D so we come back to our work and we put there D the initial is D yeah, so after putting the D, the, the cost puts itself $100. The, the cost of, of the developer was $100. Yeah, then the next one, it is here. Purchase software. Let's see the question. Purchase software, it has a resource initial of TP. So we go back to our work, we put in T and then P. T and P. Yeah, the, the cost is $500. Yeah, and it is for the train and then the developer even yeah, it's for the train and the developer the word is supposed to bring itself then we go to the next the next one is purchase hardware it has an initial of p so purchase hardware here it has an initial of p Yeah, it's for the programmer. It brings itself. And the cost is 300. Then another one is for land topology and the initial is D. So we come back to our work. Land topology here. And then we put D. Yeah, it's for the developer and the cost is a hundred dollars then we go back again to our work for tracking and cabling it's DP tracking and cabling it's this one it is DP so you put D, comma, and then P. The cost is 400. Yeah. D is for developer, P is for programmer. It puts itself there. Then continue. The next one it is for hardware installation. Hardware installation it is T. So we come here and put it there. T. For trainer it is the cost is two hundred dollars. Trainer it puts itself there. Then the next one. The next one is TD, software installation. Software installation is this one, T and then D, T, comma, and D. It is $300, trainer and developer. The name puts itself there. Then... Another one we have is for programmer testing, it is P, then here it is T, then D. So, P, T, D. 
here it's P and it's 300 then here it is T and it is 200 then here it is D it is 100 so the total cost of the project it is $2,500 yeah and for the project scope it is $100 for purchase of equipment it is $800 for system design it is $500 for installation of equipment it is $500 then for system testing it is $600 and the total is $2,500 yeah, and that is how we determine the total project cost. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment. Yeah, you can put your questions in the comment section. We shall start from there in the next videos.